Hello, my name is Marius and this is the HPC NRW tutorial on SexPy with OpenMP GPU offloading. So, what is OpenMP for GPU offloading? First of all, OpenMP is a directive-based parallel programming interface that supports programming languages like C, C++ and Fortran on many platforms. Starting from version 4.0 of the OpenMP specification, it is supported to offload computations from the CPU to a GPU as target device. A normal execution of a program is on the CPU, aka host device, with one or several tens of threads. OpenMP GPU offloading means that during the execution, the computations can be offloaded from host to a target device, for example a GPU, with hundreds of thousands of threads, and thus achieve unprecedented performance. Moreover, OpenMP GPU offloading is supported by many open source and commercial compilers, for example GCC, CLang, Quay, IBM compilers and the NVIDIA HPC Software Development Kit. Software developers can simply add OpenMP directives in the source code and rebuild the application using an OpenMP GPU offloading enabled compiler to leverage the power of GPU computation. But first, let's quickly recap what a SexPy looks like. We have to copy two arrays to the device memory, compute A times X plus Y there, and then copy back the results. In CPU only code, shown here, this is quickly done, since we do not need any copies. To implement GPU offloading, we only need to add a few OpenMP directives to this code. Here you can see the code for a SexPy with OpenMP GPU offloading. Compared with the CPU only code, the only additions are include OMP.h, which includes the OpenMP header file and three lines of OpenMP directives for GPU offloading. The first line of the OpenMP directives is separated into two parts. The first part, Pragma OMP target, creates a target region on the GPU for offloading computations. Once the CPU thread encounters this directive, the target region on the GPU is created. The second part, map to from, maps variables between the host data environment and device data environment. Map2 will map the variables to the device before execution of the SexPy code, whereas map from will map the variables back from the GPU to the host after the execution of the code. Concerning the SexPy, A, X and Y are inputs. Therefore, the map type is 2 for them. On the other hand, Z is the output vector and the corresponding map type is from for Z after the SexPy computation is complete. The second line of the OpenMP directives contains two important specifications. The Pragma OMP Teams construct initializes a league of teams to execute the SexPy on the GPU. As you can see from here, when this OpenMP directive is encountered, many teams of GPU threads are launched. The default shared clause specifies the data sharing attributes for the involved variables to be implicitly shared among all teams on the GPU. The last line of the OpenMP directives, Pragma OMP Distributed Parallel 4, is a composite construct. When this directive is encountered, all iterations of the for loop are first distributed into chunks for the GPU teams. Then, the iterations in each chunk are further distributed across the, the GPU threads within the teams to achieve massive parallelization, for example, hundreds of thousands of GPU threads running the sex track implementation simultaneously. Because of such a massive parallelism, it is expected to obtain high performances for a sex pie, especially when the involved vectors become large enough. Now, let us benchmark the performance of the sex pie implemented by using OpenMP GPU offloading with respect to the hardware theoretical memory bandwidth. Here we are using an NVIDIA V100 GPU for the benchmark, which features a theoretical memory bandwidth of 900 GB per second 
as indicated by the horizontal green line in the plot. For a sexper vector of 10 million elements, we can achieve more than 500 gigabytes per second for the GPU memory bandwidth. As the size of the vectors increases, the measured GPU memory bandwidth increases steadily and finally satellites at about 725 gigabytes per second. Let's summarize the implementations of the SexPy kernel via OpenMP GPU offloading. The three most important OpenMP directives are given below. First, the Pragma OMP target map construct creates the target region on the GPU and also maps the relevant variables between host and device data environments. Then, the Pragma OMP Teams directive initializes a league of teams for the SexPy execution on the GPU. The last OpenMP directive, Pragma OMP Distributed Parallel 4, distributes the iterations in the parallel work sharing loop across all GPU threads in the teams to achieve the best performance for the SexPy. The GPU memory bandwidth is then benchmarked against the hardware theoretical performance. A SexPy computation with sufficiently large vectors can steadily achieve 725 gigabytes per second memory bandwidth on an NVIDIA V100. This value corresponds to 80% of the theoretical memory bandwidth. So much for the OpenMP GPU offloading and see you in another video.